even my pot plant is tired hard times but hard times never last only hard time bras everything that you need to know about bras where do you get this bra what size is your bra can i get it online Da 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 Yeah, it's my life. Hey yummies, welcome back to our channel. If you're new, please click the subscribe button down below and be yummified and be part of our yummy fam. Um, yeah, basically that's really what you need to do because when you click and watch people's videos but you're not subscribed it's very shady <laughs> anyway today i'm speaking all things bras the highly requested question all over my social media i know we will say this without vaping proof <laughs> but i promise you <laughs> i get this if not every week probably every second week so i'm just gonna get straight into it so if you want to watch all things bras i guess and where i get my bras stay tuned and let's go question that is often asked is obviously where do you get your bras and the simple answer to that is literally everywhere everywhere I say and when I say everywhere I mean everywhere um and obviously the popular one that I usually uh state is Woolworths to a point that this one time this lady was like please don't say Woolworths and I was like but Tundasa, it's really where I get my bras so yeah but anyway so yeah that's a simple answer um most of my bras are definitely from Woolworths um I also get them I'm gonna name brands and where you could get these brands Woolworths Distraction definitely I haven't tried Studio W but I've seen it as well this is also before you ask me this is also Distraction from Woolies also this is also from Woolies Woolies should have definitely sponsored this video but anyway, we move. Um, and then Playtex. Playtex was actually my very first um, brand bra. Bra, you know. Um, when I started growing boobs, uh, my mom got me a nude and a white Playtex bra. <laughs> Guys, I've never worn those sports things. Let me show you. I've actually never. Like, my boobs just grew so big that I just had to just dive into the things these cute sports thingies i've never worn those like ever um obviously not ever because now i have one but when, when i was growing up you know how we first start with like cute sport bras yeah i've never had those so yeah i got a place that play takes um bra for my mommy to a nude and a white i still remember i think i was probably in grade six yeah or five so um it's woolies playtex triumph triumph is also a really good brand that's where i get my strapless uh black bra it's the only strapless bra that i have um and obviously there's tricks to how you wear your bra strapless sometimes i don't even wear any strapless bra or any bra and i've obviously got tricks to how you can adjust your uh bra to basically keep the babies in if you want um that video as well and how to maybe measure your boob size let me know down below so triumph you get it for shiny playtex you get it for shiny as well as well as truets uh truets also has their own brand so i do also get stuff from truets let me check um i think it's in something 
intrigue yeah intrigue from true words where else i also get some from uh, bras and things bras and things always has these nice sales that i absolutely love and adore so i only go there when there's those sales because wow yeah no hey yo um bras and things from bras and things and where else i also get them from oh and I, I know of a lady who said she gets hers from Lesenza. I've always thought Lesenza has small cups, so I've never been in there um for for bras, but obviously for G strings, because I wear G strings, um I do go in just generally everywhere. And then Donna also has um their own brand, but they also house Triumph and Playtex. So those have been like my consistent brands overall. Um, yeah, but I do know definitely for everyday wear, I do love a Playtex bra. Um, Playtex can also sponsor this. <laughs> anyway, yeah. And then I'm just going to show you ones that I, I own. This um, trendy one that trended on Twitter with a cute back here you see it's got this cute lace detail at the back for when you want to um, wear um, anything open back and you want something cute to show then you can wear this this I got from Woolies it's this distraction range even with the pink one I'm gonna try and and uh, source out pictures where I'm wearing these and then just post them as I'm talking but I definitely know I do have a picture wearing this one so I'm gonna post it right here with its twin which is the pink one which is also from Woolworths distraction range they have sizes they have my size my thing I tea they have sizes they have my size because some people go up to G and H and I don't think they have like bigger cup size and stuff but they do have like a bigger band. So I always say the trick is to when you increase a uh, band, you can go down a cup size. So look into um, doing that as well. So this and the twin Woolies distraction range, it's an F. So if you're an F, you will definitely get this. And then when you look into t-shirt bras like this one. T-shirt bras like this they usually have this foam cup thing in my body i don't usually go for these ones simply because obviously like i don't need padding i literally already have enough padding and they have lots and lots and lots of padding never mind my nails they're very crusty it's locked down y'all um yeah but um these you hardly find in your size at woolworths because the only girls who deserve foam and the dondons are basically a smaller cup sizes according to woolies of course so at woolies they'll definitely have the lacy ones which i love i love the lacy ones because i just feel like i really don't need any more than i have you know yeah and then obviously this one then i get from i got as a three pack at true words and the nice thing about it is that it comes out here so you can do a cute crisscross i don't have a picture wearing this one so you'll just have to imagine it <laughs> yeah you can do it as a crisscross at the back for when you sometimes you know when you're wearing a sports bra and it's not supportive i'm going to show you now like which one and you don't want it to show at the back because it's obviously like this at the back then you can do the crisscross here when you wear two bras which i don't think you should but i mean if it doesn't have support you have to make a plan so you do a crisscross on this one and that's what i usually do when a sports bra is not supportive and then this one is from intrigue to it and i'm going to show you the sports bra thing that i'm talking about it's this one this one i got because i was in cape town I was broke I just wanted to run with my friend and then I got this cute um, detail back sports bra like look how detailed it is but obviously because of the stretch oh, what's that because because of the stretch it's then not so supportive 
because it just stretches. So then what I'll do is I'll wear this, put the crisscross at the back, nah, and then wear this baby. And try to run, but I wouldn't definitely not recommend it. <laughs> just get a good sports bra. Good sports bra, I have a Nike sports bra, two of them. Nah? Pink one and a black one. The black one is smaller than the pink one, but this was like two years ago. It fitted perfectly. In fact, the pink one or pink one is even uh, bigger. But what I've obviously realized is that I picked up weight and the boobs have grown as well due to that. So they basically don't fit. They fit, but they like push the girls out, you know. Um, yeah. So yeah, just invest in a good sports bra. I'm still looking for a place where I can get a really good sports bra. Once I do know, I'm going to come back to you. But I do know of an Instagram boutique. If I remember the name, I'm just going to link it on the comments section or in the description box below. Otherwise, I'll definitely want to do a separate video for just sports bras because they are an issue, a deep issue on their own. So this is from mr price like i said before i was really interrupted that this is from mr price definitely not recommended it's basically a top that will hold this part of your area so that the boots don't pop out just it was just for convenience honestly yeah so like i said sports bras deserve their own video if you guys want that as well please comment down below the next we have did i tell you guys about that one yo i said i was buying a but i hope it's in the middle because i want to tell you guys about the trick where you can crisscross here at the back and then what happens is um because it the sports bra comes like this then these will be hidden at the back um so that it doesn't show that you're wearing two bras because I mean, when you're wearing this, like what support is it giving you? None. So you'd wear this with that. But don't do it when you have an option not to, you know? And the next bra. I was really shocked to find this bra in my size because cute details are really, never really made in bigger sizes. And especially because it was also at Woolworths. And not at Woolworths, at Truett's. And it's this cute bra that looks like a bralette and it's got four hooks right here which is absolutely cute i love it and obviously um this part this part at the bottom sticks on your what's this your waist type of vibe it looks really cute and i don't have a picture wearing this one but visualize and imagine how cute this would look on you okay and it's uh, the brand Intrigue from Truett's. So this is also a really, really great, great one. Um, they don't, it has, they don't feel like they would last that long. But I mean, it's cute. And I'm not going to wear it every day. Like I have everyday bras. And I have bras for like feeling good, self-care Sunday, <laughs> self-love, you know. Um, or for that time, you know. <laughs> you know. Yeah, so intrigue from Truett. It comes in a three pack bra. Is it two or three pack? Two. And um, I got this pink one and a blue one. And then um, what else can I say? Yes, the next um, place that I get my bras at is definitely from Bras and Things. And they're really cute. Or whatever but the price can be on the steep side so what you want to do is just go there when there are sales right and this cute little baby right here I got it from them I also have a picture and this is a video I mean there's a video where I did um, where I was wearing this as well so I would link it down below that you, you can go see how it looks and stuff or just leave a picture here as well and honestly guys that's really about it and this like i said this piece it's it's actually a bodysuit i got it from distraction woods and that's about it honestly so if you want more details around how do you 
measure your um, boob size, uh, sports bras, um, body suits, lingerie, comment all of those things down below and any other thing related to what I just said on this video and I'll definitely, definitely make time to comment and reply on each and every one of them and also make another video based on what you guys comment down below and what you need more and stuff like that. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching. Please do the right thing and subscribe because if you got to this point of this video and you didn't subscribe, you are definitely shady. So don't be a shady person. It's 2020, darling. Be merry, be jolly, be yummified. <laughs> Peace out. Cheers.